click the bell icon to get latest videos from ekida hello friends today we are going to see how to inspect a welded part when your part is being welded and it has some defects the first stage which is there is inspection so how to do that there are different processes which we are going to see in this video testing is just visual testing so what you have to do is you just have to see your weld up and down here and there on the much possible basis on which you can see you have to see it and if you find any crack void or any things which can be visually seen you can just see it and tell that these are the defects and you have to counter that it is the quickest and the easiest way of testing welding but it is not reliable as it is only a visual test only you can see the outer surface testing or you can see the outer surface cracking but internal testing cannot be done just by visual inspection the second testing is penetration testing if a hollow object is to be welded is to be made for example a pipe you can do this kind of testing known as penetration testing what you have to do is you can pass any of the fluid between that pipe or inside that pipe if it is welded properly the fluid would enter and it would leave at the other point but if the welding is not proper like if there are some voids crack your fluid may come out so this is known as a penetration test it is reliable in case of hollow objects this test is known as magnetic particle testing so what happens in this iron particles are present in your weld so it can be only detected by using a magnet so basically you can detect voids cracks extra inclusion like slag inclusion or anything through magnetic testing so it is a very reliable testing and it is accepted universally when you are using heavier material you need heavy magnets so this is the basis of magnetic testing this testing is known as ultrasonic testing so as the name is ultrasonic you just have to pass ultrasonic waves through that casting or through that welded portion it has to penetrate thoroughly in your weld and if any voids crack or anything occurs between your weld it doesn't pass properly so this is the basis of ultrasonic testing it can solely be inspected by using ultrasonic waves so hence this test is a bit costly so this test is known as radiographic testing basically in this test what you have to do is you have to pass x rays through different parts of your product like let's say you are designing a boiler you have made a boiler after doing your explosive welding process or anything you just have to pass radiographic rays that is your x rays at different parts of your boilers so what happens your x rays pass and if any voids or crack occur it may just flash it so this is the basis of radiographic testing Thank you for watching this video stay tuned with Ikeda and do subscribe our channel Ikeda